True. Hey, y'all, today, man. Well, first of all, how everybody doing, man? You know, troopers and troopettes, is what I'm going to call y'all. Man, I have a, a friend girl that has a strong mind and great eyes. I mean, she has spectacular insight. And she told me something that she spotted on YouTube and Instagram. She says it's a, well, she showed it. It is. It does exist. A Mo3 TV page. And she's like, we was talking and she like, hold up. It's the family, it's the family benefiting from this page? Or who put this page together? And uh, we got a little bit more into it. So she told, she told, she showed me that the same things that's on this Mo3 TV uh, channel on YouTube is also on Rainwater's page. And we got the got a little deep into it. I'm like, damn, you got some great eyes because hey, I ain't even I ain't even spot that. So I'm like, so first thing we said was, is it Empire Records that's benefiting? Because they hooked up with Apple Music. So they definitely making money if the music on the page, on the channel. And then she, she takes me to Rainwater's Instagram page. And lo and behold, <laughs> some of the same content that's on Rainwater's Instagram page is also on Mo3 TV YouTube channel. And y'all remember, Rainwater and Empire could not get the password to the HSM account, which is the which is Mo 3's official YouTube channel. So when he when he passed away, he took the password with him. So me and me and Shay, we like who who benefiting from this? Because is it if Rainwater and set up this page and making money, it it's to go to his children and his family. So I want y'all to support the mind of Shay, S H A E. She's got it going on. She has great content. She's a little shy, but I'm like Shay, you got to share all all this knowledge with the world. I mean, it's women out there, it's men out there with 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 all that with them great eyes and that strong mind and all that good insight. You got a lot to offer, and that's what YouTube needs more and more: the truth, truth tellers. You know, because there's a lot going on in this world right now. She's the go-to girl for that. So, like I told y'all, we're one big family over here. So, y'all, please, please, please go subscribe to The Mind of Shay. Once again, S-H-A-E. And I'm going to try to leave a link. This is her. This is the video she put together and she want to share, share it with the world, y'all. Pay attention and let's stay true. True.
Attention, attention, attention. All y'all bloggers, all y'all fans, all the YouTube people who, who wanted to pick up negative drama yesterday. I need y'all go make sure y'all go post seven, give it back to the needy. Because y'all thought it was so negative yesterday. I couldn't wait for y'all to pick up some negative shit. Y'all couldn't wait to pick up some negative shit. You know what I'm saying? Go post this shit. Man. Go post it. Three, I mean, seven, give them back, back to the needy. RP Mo 3. Go download Murder Who. I got so many burglar of habitations. What's the, what's the throw this good you Made Dallas all the way fall off. So when it, when it fell off, I started breaking the houses. It got right to the point. Except we, we got to get to it. When, 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 that, fish, when Dallas started falling off, I started breaking the houses. What, what? what led to the prison? Oh yeah, I went straight to jail. Man. True, true. Hey man, uh, Yesterday was an amazing day, y'all. I had fun, fun, fun. Sit my bored ass in the house. But I had fun uh, making a video I made yesterday and in my live chat with my with my troopers. But uh, today, today, early morning, it's about what the fuck time it is. It's 1.36 a.m. over here in, in Memphis, Tennessee. So let me see what the hell I want to talk about. Now I ain't finna talk about nothing. I'm finna tell y'all. Now I'm finna show y'all right quick. It's gonna be a short, short video. But I'm finna show y'all another case of social media, guns, and a lot of damn black people. This is a party bus in Brooklyn with 41 people on a party bus. <laughs> 
And uh, it's a pandemic out here. But it's a it's a party bus that had a whole lot of damn weapons on it. I'm talking about everybody was strapped on their bitch. They had all the dogs and three juveniles. They was ready for war. <laughs> I'm talking about them folks was strapped to the T. Now, is that a party bus or what in the hell kind of bus is that? They finna go pull a stain. They finna go uh, step. They finna slide. 41 people deep on the party bus. Got to ask yourself, does the owner of the party bus company know? Or is this the, yeah, shh, don't tell nobody. I ain't finna tell nobody. But, uh, yeah, they just packed on the damn bus in the middle of the damn pandemic, strapped up. I'm going to tell you what it is, though, real quick. It's another case of uh, social media takes, sends another motherfucker to jail. In this case, 18 motherfuckers to jail. It's another case of social media gone bad, y'all. It's another it's another case of 15 minutes of fame. In this case, y'all know what they did, right? They got on that party bus, went on social media, flashing them guns and their money. As as the as if they didn't know, as if they don't <laughs> nobody believe. Man, the police don't even do investigation no more. They do social media accounts, though. I'm talking about Feds got a YouTube page. Feds got an Instagram page. State police got the same thing. TikTok, Twitter, fucking shit. I'm saying, man, uh, but y'all check this video out. True. I ain't gonna say nothing else, though. <laughs> Funny. A party bus found packed with people and weapons. And that's what police say they discovered in Brooklyn after a tip. CBS 2's Jessica Moore reports. Cell phone video shows the moment police bust a party bus full of guns around 1230 Friday morning. They were uh, just doing their duties. They started to get hear rumblings about this, um, this party bus that was carrying all these guns, these individuals with all these guns. The squad quickly and identified the bus and found a safe location to pull it over. That place was the corner of Front and York Streets in Dumbo, Brooklyn. After following up on social media chatter, police just... There you go, y'all. After following up on social media chatter, I better uh, take heed. Covered eight loaded guns inside the bus, along with 58 rounds of ammunition seen here. They arrested 14 people, including 11 adults and three juveniles. I want to praise the officers as they continue to take the guns off our streets. The situation is also raising COVID concerns, as police say 41 people were on board the bus, possibly celebrating an 18th birthday party. On its website, the CEO of Party Bus Express LLC says a party bus is a better alternative for events because people will only be exposed to guests they're familiar with. The statement goes on to say, quote, continue the party without hesitation. Party Bus Express declined to comment on the arrest involving one of its buses, but insists its COVID precautions are adequate. The Department of Health would not comment on COVID capacity restrictions for private bus companies. We also reached out to the governor's office, but have not yet heard back. Those arrested now face weapons charges. Jessica Moore, CBS 2 News. What y'all think about that, man? Get in the comments and tell me, is this another case? This just happened Friday. You know, they was out partying. So get in the comments, man. Let true results know. Is this another case of social media gone bad? Is it that serious? Yes, it's that serious. This is what they want, y'all. They want distraction. Total distraction. Now I'm talking about everything dumb and stupid is what they want us to continuously do. They want us to not care about the pandemic. They want us to be in that. They want us to get frustrated. They want us to go stir crazy. Man, we don't have to go stir crazy. We could just take this opportunity to 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 drink some coffee, uh, smoke a cigarette, smoke some weed, look around, open your eyes to pay attention. Cause uh, this is how they gonna win. It's a new world, all the brand new day. True results, man. I'm a holly child.